Hey guys, happy Thanksgiving. Um, I'm not sure if this video will actually be posted on Thanksgiving, but anyway, I'm making this on Thanksgiving. So this is going to be a book haul. I got one, two, three, four, five books recently. Um, I'm actually not going to be doing that many book hauls coming up after like this one. Hopefully, because I want to like stay away from buying any more books since it's going to be Christmas soon. And I need to get things for other people so I can't spend my money. Okay, moving on. Um, the first book I got is Princess for Hire. And it's a small book. It's actually published by Disney. And um, it's about a girl who sort of has the magical ability to transform into princesses. And she's with this agency and stuff, and it, it's it's a little confusing. I kind of was confused when I read the biography. So I recommend you go check it out. It's um going to be a really quick read. I just started it like an hour ago. But the thing about this is I love the shape it's in. I don't know why. It's like, um, this is probably like a normal book, and then it's a little smaller. But it's not like one of those little ones. I don't know. I just love this. The second one I got is Jennifer Jabbly and it's called Crush Control. And she wrote she um wrote the book called Lipstick Apology, which I have actually reviewed, so go check that out if you want to. And Lipstick Apology was really good, so I'm excited for this one. It's basically a girl hypnotizes her best friend when she's like little, when she's nine years old, I think. Um and she hypnotizes her current best friend to be her best friend forever. So they move away and then they move back and things are kind of different, I guess. It's confusing. No, no, I just make everything confusing. Um, so these coming three, they're all buy to get the third free from Barnes & Noble. So that's what I did because I love those kind of sales. And um... This was Winter Girls. It's by Lori House Anderson. I've heard pretty good things about it. It's best friends and they both like make a pact to see who can lose the most weight. Then one of them dies and it's about how one of the girls, she has to deal with it. And it seems like a book that's really deep. That sounded cheesy, a deep book, but um, yeah, I'm excited to read this one. I'll probably cry a little bit. The next one is Extraordinary by Nancy Whirlin. And I looked online and I think it might be a sequel, or maybe just a companion novel, but I hope it's not a sequel, because I don't want to, I hate, I hate buying books, and then you find out it's actually like the third or the fourth or something. I hate doing that. I don't think, I think in this case it's just a companion I'm hoping. See, that's the, supposedly the first one, because I looked on the back after I bought it, and I was like, oh. But it's about this girl named Phoebe, who finds herself drawn to Mallory, and the two become really close, and then Mallory's, sis, Mallory's brother appears, and sort of, it's about like, I don't know, it's like, they both have a dangerous hold on Phoebe, and it's, um, yeah. It says, intensely page-turning this follow-up to Nancy Worland's best-selling novel, Impossible. So, I don't know. But, I'm sure other people do that, too. Like, they buy a book, and then it's, like, the third in a series. They really should make that more clear on the back of books. Because I've done that a lot. Not recently, but yeah. Okay, and this one, which I've heard nothing but good reviews about, is Looking for Alaska by John Green. And it also has this shiny award. And, um, I guess I'm not gonna do the biography of the book this time because, um, I think you can find it online. This is kind of exciting because I've read so many reviews and I've actually seen a bunch of video reviews too. But I don't know that much about what it's about. And I'm gonna try to keep it that way because I think it will be more mysterious and exciting when I actually read it. <laughs> um, yeah, if that makes sense. But yeah, thanks guys for watching and I hope you had a great holiday. And yeah, almost December. Woot.